We are now on part three of my Tulum Bachelorette series. We got up a little late after the craziness of the day before and went off to rent some bikes and some e-scooters. We were really trying to save on the crazy taxi rides. However, we didn't know how treacherous it would be to get anywhere outside of the town. So finally, we ended up taking a cab the second half of the way, but we did make it to our cenote. We went to Grand Cenote and surprisingly, it wasn't that busy. I thought this was one of the more popular ones, but I found it to be absolutely beautiful. We snorkeled, we went into the caves, and did a little bit of sunbathing. Then we made the crazy bike over to our weaving workshop. Now, I was really looking forward to this one. I'm a really artistic person, so I did want to incorporate an activity like this into my trip, and I figured that pottery would just be too difficult to bring home. Overall, I really enjoyed this experience. It was really relaxing, and the girl who ran it is such a sweetheart. I would highly recommend doing this if you're in Tulum. It's called Tulum Art Studio. On our way back, we stopped for more tacos and margaritas and made our way back to get ready for our Botch Made in Heaven theme night. Feathers, glitter, gold was the vibe and the girls really showed up. We played all of your classic Bachelorette games and we were technically supposed to stay in this night, but a couple of us did sneak out and take the e-scooters out to the club where we met up with the boys. We weren't supposed to see them until the following day, but we just couldn't resist and they said this place was fun and they were not lying. The bar is called Straw Hat. It's part of a hostel and it was not on our itinerary at all. We went to a bunch of expensive places in Tulum and this was by far one of my favorite parts. They kept pulling me up on the bar and giving me these sparklers, which I mean, I'm not mad about it. They had this crazy wheel that you'd spin and you'd have to do what it landed on. We loved it so much we went back the next night. It was just such an unexpected part of our trip. 